Good morning. This is October the 5th, and this is Diva's Kids. Uh, they're doing really, really good. They are six weeks, two days old. They've had their first set of puppy shots. I'm going to try and get around at an angle that will let me let you see them. Oh, oops, there went my... So hopefully we have enough battery to get me through this. Um, they're doing everything they should be doing at this age. They haven't seen mom for about a day, and unfortunately, I really want you to be able to see him with mom. So we're going to stick her in just for a minute, and it's probably going to make him mad because we're going to take her back out in a few minutes. So, But I really would like to see have you have the opportunity to get to see her with her puppy since we did it with everybody else. So Vanessa's going to put her in, and the kids are going to go, oh, my mom's here. Uh, and they're only all they're going to want to do is nurse, so we're not going to leave her in here very long. She's going to walk around and smell. Can you pull this edge of my fence out just a little bit? Um, they're doing super good. They're eating dry dog food, but mom's here. They'd much rather nurse. She's not interested in it, but she'll probably stand still here in a minute and let them. Um, she's been a super good mom. Really, really good mom. This is her first litter. And she's just been really, really, really affectionate with them. Uh, very loving. She tolerates whatever they want to do. Um, she's not a real strict mom. I have moms that really have a fit when their kids, you know, either nurse and they don't want them to nurse. Diva, what are you eating? I know, but I want you to turn around and see your face. There you go. They're, got, they're hanging on for dear life. They're hanging on for dear life. See if you can get her to move around, because otherwise we'll just take her out, because I don't want him to nurse on her this long. They really don't need to be nursing, and but she's one of these that will stand there all day for them. So I'm going to pull her out, and uh, but I, I just really wanted you to be able to see her with her babies. So Vanessa's going to grab her and go, and the kids are going to go, wait, wait, wait. Time got away from me, and we just didn't. It was so hot about a week ago when they were at the age that would have been great to do that. Um, but we have started weaning them. So it's just she only gets to see three of them right now. And so she got to see them all again, which she really didn't seem to care a whole lot. Um, they're doing great. They're not using a doggy door yet. They're, they've had three warming so far. They've had um, their first puppy shot. And they're just doing super good. They're happy. They're playful. They're going to get a bath today. I'm going to shoot new pictures. I'm um, trying to get back on schedule this week after it's been such a crazy week last week. And uh, so we're hoping to get everything going again this week. So I have collar colors for you. And weights. This is going to be tough. I can't read my sheet and look at puppies. So I'm going to try and keep them homed in in there for you. So at least you can watch them play while I do this. So the first one is the yellow collar. And I know that yellow collar is on a chocolate puppy. Because I put it on a chocolate puppy. Oh, the one that just fell down. There it goes. I just caught a glimpse of that yellow collar. It's, it's the phantom back there in the back. And it's three pounds. Woo, where'd it go? Three pounds even. And microchip is $64.19. All right, the next one in here is neon pink. And I'm not even going to try and look. Neon pink weighs 2 pounds, 14.5. This is not easy. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I'm going to wait till Vanessa gets back here. Maybe I can scan out and let you watch them that way. Neon pink is 2 pounds, 14.5. 65.50 is the microchip number. I'm going to let you do this. Vanessa's back. I'm going to give her the camera, and I'm going to read. Because I can't keep them on the screen. I got it scanned out so it's down. I got it scanned out so you can get a bunch of other plan. And I'm not trying to find collar colors. Red is 2 pounds, 12.5, and it's the little cream running across there right now. Um, 20, or 65, 26 is the chip number. Forest green is the dark chocolate puppy that is right over there uh, closest to the mat. 2 pounds, 11.5, 65, 29 is the microchip number. And purple is the next collar, uh, 2 pounds, 12.5. And 
I'm a looking. I think it's the, it's that cream, isn't it? It's the cream laying right down here under Vanessa, chewing on the grass. Uh, and it is uh, two pounds, 12.5, 65, 35 is the microchip number. Is that a three or a two? Three, okay. Neon green collar, I know is a cream puppy and it just rolled over on its back. Um, it is three pounds, 5.5, 62.75 is the microchip. Light pink is the next one and it's clear across there, running down, well, they just crashed into it. There it is, over there all by itself on the far side of the picture on the right. Two pounds, 14 ounces, a 65.32 is the microchip number. The next one is the royal blue, which is the little teeny guy just chasing the other one over there. And uh, that is two pounds, nine ounces at 62.72 is the number. And last but not least is light blue, and it's the cream colored, buffy colored puppy down here underneath of us. And uh, it's three pounds, one ounce, 64.46. All right. And that one, let me gonna see what everybody's eating. I don't want them eating mud. Are you down here? Somebody's... Yeah, stay away from that. You guys are bad. Uh, everybody's doing really good. Nobody's got any issues at all. They're attacking each other, playing. These guys are active. Um... <laughs> These guys were wrestling back here in the back. Oh, she says, I give. I'll take it back. Ooh, that wasn't smart. All right, we've kind of chopped this video up doing this by this way, but... Um, they're eating dry dog food. They're not using a doggy door yet, but they are very social. Um, they're current on everything they can have so far. And like I said, today's bath day, toenail day, and they're going to get all that stuff done, so they'll be a whole lot look different. I want to get them a bath before I do their photos. So, other than that, there's not a whole lot of new news go on. I did send out everybody's videos uh, on an email, and I also sent you out your vitamin information. If you did not receive it, please shoot me a text with your email so I can make sure I send it to the correct email, and I will resend it back out. But all those did go out... Um, the other day and you should have it by now I mean you should have had it that same day but if you don't have it and it's not in your emails check your spam file and then if not shoot me an email and I'll send them back out to you um, I also sent out everybody's boxes so your box should have gone out to you um, with your packet your puppy toys your uh, what else is in that packet uh, your dog food and cow toe and a bell and your shampoo so you should have received that also but uh, oh, it says we're gonna attack people they're liking the grass out here today I think it's fun sometimes to just sit and watch them Next week's video, I'm going to go over shipping and a few behavior things with you when you get your puppy home. Uh, so please watch the videos that I sent you. That way, when you come to pick up your puppy, you can just write down the questions that I did not ask answer for you on the videos. And if you are having your puppy shipped to you, please feel free to call me if you have questions that I didn't answer for you on those videos. Um, just remember it's a dog. It's not a child. Don't treat it like one and you'll have such a better time. Be really tough for the first two months you have this puppy. Set down rules, boundaries, and limitations. And you'll be off to a much, much better start. There she says, don't pick on me. I'm done. Might be a little, but she doesn't take any prisoners. All right, I hope you've enjoyed their video. Um, give me a call if you have any questions or concerns. And uh, we'll have a new video on for you next week. This week's pictures will probably be their last pictures. They get insane to get to hold still on a table after their six weeks. So next week we'll probably go just to videos and uh, no more photos. So this will be probably, like I say, your last, last set of pictures. So... 
Have a good one, and we'll talk to you later.